Tell me about Steve. My brother. Yeah. My brother died of a drug overdose at the age of 50, uh, two weeks out of rehab. He started smoking uh, marijuana at the age of 11. I refuse to call my brother a drug addict. He was addicted to drugs for most of his life. But the bigger story is that my brother was born into a family with a father who loved him. I need to say that. My mm -hmm. father loved my brother. But my father could not read. My brother could not read. And my brother was a very sensitive soul. He was more sensitive than this world, you know, um, uh, allows. And I think that my father treated my brother in a way that was to toughen him up for this world. But my brother was not my father. And my brother needed something else. Mm. And my father wasn't present enough and and didn't have the ability to own his own pain in order to be sensitive to my brother. Mm. So the issue here was not drugs. Drugs were the coping mechanism. The issue was not being heard, not being seen, not being cared for in the way that you need it. My, my feeling uh, less than and not measuring up. Those were the problems unresolved for 50 years that killed my brother, mm. which is why the, the practices that I put in the little book of big lies, I mean, I, I, say, I say this without an ounce of ego. Every single page of that book is meant to expand and heal because I don't believe that we need to leave our possibility on the table unrealized. Mm.